Hi everybody. Hey everybody. So, so we've made a almost, huge mistake. We're almost dead. We've made a terrible fucking oh, mistake. We missed uh, getting the Wounded rabbit's world. foot. Yes. And the rabbit's foot is an item that it's increases lucky. your it increases your speed in yes. a big way. A huge way. <clears throat> and so we need to go get that Coach. shit. Because and also, Holy who do I way. talk to to get a fucking heel around here? Uh, <laughs> who's back? Who's back? Do I got I think it's scratch? Up there. It's that guy to get my friends yeah. back. Free stay? Is yes. it no? Oh no, it's no. the hospital. Is Shit. it the? Is it the? Is it the? Uh, the 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 hot tub? The pe the Pepto Bismol. Yeah. Uh, let's. I think it's the Pepto. Find out. It might be the Pepto. Let's find out. Anyway, we got to go find the rabbit's foot. I think it's in this. I think it's in Lou Mine Hole. Yeah. I think I think I think this is the the ticket. Ooh. Look at how bright it's getting. So after we get Look the after we get we got now, baby. After is everybody is everybody good? Is everybody back? Is everybody good to go? Is everybody max? I would I would go to sleep just in case. Yeah, good call. You never know. Why not? Never Why know. Why not? Nah, get a good night's know. rest. Get a good night's rest. Yeah, take a nice. Oh. oh. Oh, there we go. There we go. Yeah, there we go. Got to talk to him twice. There we go. Got to talk to him twice. So nice. You got to talk to him twice. Um. Yeah, so we give the rabbit's foot. So we give that. So we were dying terribly to that to the ghost of Starman. The baby put because he has the star storm, which is star uh, devastating apparently. But if you give the rabbit's foot to Kagu, she goes first. If, and if you can use uh, okay, if you, you can use shield, she, if you give a foot to Kagu and you use shield Omega. Oh. Um, Relax. Don't do it. Exactly. When you want to suffer through it. If you if give you, the shield to Kagu. If you give the shield. If you give the rat foot to Kagu, she can do the shield. She uses shield and Sorry, the ghost of... That's okay. The ghost <laughs> of Starman will use Star Storm and kill himself and hopefully everybody else. he'll be a chump. This is so laggy with all these, these fob, fobbies. Fobbies? Fabios? I hope I'm fobbies? going the right way. I think you might be. No, well, it says the upper level, but I think I need to go down and around. Down to go up. It's like west of the sanctuary boss. South of the border, west of the sun. What? What's that from? That's a Haruki Murakami novel. No, oh. it's one of my favorites by him. Nice. Yeah, he's a he's a pretty good, a pretty 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 good author. Uh, he reuses a lot of themes in his books, and a lot of people kind of criticize him for it. But yeah. I like it. I think that it's nice. It deals a lot with isolation and loneliness, and is it just really light? Oh! I do. Yeah, go on. So, yeah, he Speaking of isolation and loneliness, loneliness yeah. my my dad's calling. Click! Beep! <clears throat> oh, look at all Lag this. City! I think that might be it right there. Lag City, USA! Lag like City like is Lag my City. kind of place! That's a song that I wrote, except for it's called Babe City, not Lag City. Nice. Um... The no Haruki Murakami deals with isolation and loneliness, kind of as a uh, luxury, luxury jerky. jerky. That's kind that of a way to explore weird. human emotion. And his uh, he has a lot of absurdism, not absurdism, but like existentialism in there. And he does have some like uh, magical realism in it in some of his books that really lends to themes and overall f feeling and tone. Nice and that kind of stuff. Yeah, it's great. Uh, my favorite book by him is The Wind of Bird Chronicle, uh, which is the first book I ever read by him. Yeah. Um, it's really good. It's hard to explain his books because, <coughs> honestly, that book is kind of about how a, a man who's married to his... Uh, it's a... <gasps> there we got go. Got it. See? Boom. We got, got it. it. I didn't take that long. Not that long at all. Now we got to get out. Whoa. Well, give it to Kagu before we forget. Oh, good call. I could use the exit mouse. I don't think we're going to need it from here on Let's out. do it. Let's exit that okay, mouse. Okay, hold on. Um, but it's about a man and his wife uh, living together in a house, and then his cat runs away. And then he tries to find his cat, and then his wife actually leaves. Um, and so it's kind of about that and kind of uh, his search to try and find his cat and also to try and, like... Get his wife back. Wow. Yeah. Dude, that's deep. But it has a lot to do with magical realism, and it has a lot... To, there's a whole bunch of other different, like, subtones to it, but the main story is kind of that. Wow, that's cool. Yeah. Uh, it's a really neat book, and it, it was the first book I ever read by him. It has a certain place and time for me. 
Oh uh, yeah, yeah, it's great. Yeah, I, have I books, love. I have books like that. Yeah, books that have music like that. Certain, certain. It reminds you of certain memories. Yeah, yeah. That's actually. I read that probably in 2009 was when I read Wonderbird Chronicle, and with that I also have LCD sound systems. This is happening. Um, I have like certain things that go together in that point in time that yeah. that kind of like define that era for me. Yeah. It's very interesting how you hold on to those certain memories with those certain things. You almost, like, gauge time by them in a way. Yeah, by when you did those things, yeah. File, or, file, file everything in that time period under when you were listening to that And it's kind of, it, it, it gives you a piece of history with it, you know? And it kind of is like, this has, <clears throat> this book has value. This has a piece of history in, in yeah. it now. Because it has this one place that I can just, like, remember where I was why I related so much to it. Yeah, well, and the bummer is is that a lot of people... That sometimes, like, prevents them from enjoying it in the future. Yeah, that's totally true. Because, like... Absolutely. Sometime, and, like, I guess I have some things that are... Oh, what the fuck? Why? How did that why? happen? I have no idea. You totally snuck up against him. I thought so. What? Okay, good. What a... Good. What a... I don't know, but like what? I, there. I also believe that like if you just if you try hard enough, you can re-establish bonds with music and stuff like that in a different well, way. Well, and it's kind of like you might not like that time. Yeah. But you can at least you can appreciate, appreciate it. it is a piece of your history. Yeah. With it too, so. I mean, you might not... There are certain things that I don't want to ever probably listen to again. Yeah. But at least I associate it. Like, I still have that in my head. Yeah. Like, I just... Like, I bought... You You were in the car with me. I just recently rebought Green Day's Dookie. Dookie, yeah. And that totally is the first... One of the first two CDs that I ever got. Like, compact discs. And I remember the boombox that came with is a moment of truth. Okay, I'm gonna... I say bash him. And then use the PSI. Oops, yep. Yeah. Uh, shield. Did you did you give it to Kagu and equip yes, it? Yes, I did. Okay, cool. Yes, I did. The, um, I'll just keep doing this too. Okay, we'll see. Here it is. Go. Moment of truth. Ooh. Let's see if this was worth it. Let's see Connected. if this was all worth it. Um, but it reminds me of when I was young, very young, and my mom bought that for me, but she bought. Oh, here we go. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, that's good. Oh, so it just killed okay. Him so it just killed him. That's, that's all right. Cool, that's though. that. He, that was that was the tricky part. Yeah. So that'll be good from now on because these guys we can just beat with bashes. Yeah, it totally takes me to a place where it's like this is. I remember the boombox that my mom got me during yeah. Christmas. I got a boombox CD player. And nice. I got those two CDs. It was that and Boys to Men's two. Yeah. Um, I'll make love to you. Yeah. Like you. Which, why is my mom buying me that hit single, I'll make love to you? Yeah. I liked, I loved that song. I don't thanks, know why. Thanks, Bob. Yeah, thanks, Bob. <laughs> that and then uh, Dookie. And the only song that I couldn't listen to on there was Longview. Not because it was about masturbation, but because it said the, the F word in it. Oh, really? It oh. It had one F word. Dude, oh, hey. hey. Oh, Wazgi, you finally showed up. There are plenty of creepy monsters running around on it now. Thanks for telling me, Mom. Yeah. The townspeople are barricaded in their homes, afraid to go out. I'm fine, but I'm a bit scared. Everything will be okay if we just sit here quietly in the dark. Are you hungry? Are you hungry? Do you want to eat, some, you eat salmon? some salmon? Yes, I do. How can you get salmon at a time like this? Like, where's, she just she stays stuck. Where's the? Uh, are you more relaxed? She oh, stays stuck. Oh, I'm relaxed. I'm gonna the, call uh, Mom. Oh, I can't, dude. That's funny. Well, you can't, you're not homesick anymore. Probably. Well, I can't call her from the house yeah. phone, dude. The call is coming from inside the house. Holy shit, we've got so much money. We need to use it. We need to use that. Use that moolah. We do, dude. This is crazy. This is really cool. Okay, let's, um... I want to see... Nostalgia, though, am I right? Absolutely. Speaking of nostalgia, I want to see if Tracy's here. I re recently rewatched Star Wars again, by the way. I went to the theaters and rewatched it. Episode Speaking 7. Of nostalgia. Yeah, episode 7. And you know what? It holds up. I think it was pretty solid, you know. Yeah. I think that Han Solo was great in it. Chewbacca was great. I think. <laughs> I think uh, with the acting, it yeah. was it was good. It was, was it was great. yeah. It was it was a really good movie. It was. You know, I've seen it three times in the theater now. Each time, still solid. Even nice. when I knew what was going on. 
Nice. On that yeah. note. On that note, I think this is a great place to end. Talking about nostalgia, sitting in our uh, childhood bedroom. Yeah, there you go. Tune in next time when we uh, go take on the fucking monsters that have destroyed our town. <laughs> I don't know why I did that. Do you wonder if there was posters at some party in his like like? The, what, you know what, how what like kind of stuff he put up on the wall. Yeah. yeah. What do you think Wazgi would have posters wise? Probably <laughs> yeah. a baseball player. Maybe maybe baseball. He does like he does have like yeah, he baseball has an bats and for stuff. baseball bats and hats. Or like. Um, do you think? Yeah, I don't know. Maybe uh maybe a mentalist. Yeah, probably. I don't know. Do you think like I don't know how well or like what at what age he got his powers and stuff. Maybe a Farrah Fawcett poster. Mm-hmm.